Yo! Yep, I'm back. So, I am going to show you how you would get scammed in Morocco. I got broads in Atlanta, just a dolly in the family. Credit cards in the scammers, hitting the licks in the van. Legacies, family. Not just in Morocco, anywhere in the world. This scam is international, it's prolific. And let's see if you guys fall for it. Um, oh, let's get a table. Right, I'm ready. Do this. You guys think you're you think you're it, yeah? I well, you need to leave comments if you got it. But let's do this. Okay, so this is called the uh, uh, following the ladies. Um. Let me explain it. Set you up. You guys ready? No lying either. If I, if you don't get it, don't, there's no, there's no reason to lie about it. Okay, leave it in the comment if you got it. If you didn't, leave it in the comment as well. Okay. Table's a bit wobbly. But let's get to it. We have three cards. I'm gonna have you follow the queen. The queen is the money card. So this is the money card. You gotta keep your eyes on the money card. Okay? No lying. If you don't get this, please leave in the comment. Okay, so you'd be out there in you'd be out there in the street anyway. And then they'll say to you, 20 pounds placed on the red queen. And if you get it, you win the money. Okay, so. Where would you say the queen is? One, two, or three? Okay, so if you said it is at number one, you'd be correct. So now they'd say to you, why not put down some more money? How about even um, 50 pounds and just follow where the queen is? Where would you say it is now? One, two, or three? Okay, if you said one, you'd be wrong. If you said two, you'd be wrong. See, most of you thought this card would not be it. But it is, this is the winning card. And that's how the scam goes, basically. Um, that usually reel you in with the first bit. I actually played this in Marrakesh on the, the square at Jamath Na. It's called, and I beat them. They were trying to scam me. Um, I won, and they got really funny about it. They, because basically you've got to put. Sorry about this rip on my shirt. I should just rip this shirt. Maybe not. <laughs> I see the outfit I've got at the second. Anyway, so I was at the Jamef Fenar, it was a hot night, delicious food everywhere, like sheep's heads and stuff like that all around us, and monkeys performing, cobras. <laughs> and then, so you've got to put your money down on the card you think it is. I put my money down on the card I thought it was, and they didn't want to pay me out because I knew the secret. If you lost, you would like to know the secret, or you would like to get scammed. Scammed or not scammed? Now don't get scammed. What you should do really is never play this game. Because even when you think you're right, you could be wrong. Because they could be bluffing, or double bluffing, or triple bluffing, or bluffing that they're bluffing, or bluffing that they're bluffing that they're bluffing. You get what I mean. It gets very confusing. But I'll share that little bit with you. I might do another video in the future on a more advanced version of how they get into like techniques of bending the corner and stuff like that. But I haven't got a camera operator at the second, it's very difficult. Let's be honest, I'm fed up with this t shirt. Rip it. Great. 
It's like a bin in the scrap. Sugar. This ain't a good look. I need to get home. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I ripped that. <laughs> All right, I need to get home. When I get in, I'll go. If the kids are gaming, I'll rip my t-shirt again. I'll do what I done last time. I thought that was pretty funny. Well, I enjoyed it. Even if the kids didn't, I really enjoyed it. All right, so that's how not to get scammed. Just don't play the game. Free card Monte. So it boils down to free card Monte. Do not play it. Bend, bend, bend. I got bribes in the land, just to me in the family. Credit cards in the scams, hitting the licks in the van. Legacies, family, Wayne City.